Hi everyone, I'm JD from Willow Bound Journals. Welcome back to my channel. So excited to share with you these two new journals, my collage journals, vintage French themed. And we've got a yellow one here and a blue themed one over there. If you look at the covers, they both have three signatures each. This one with yellow binding and this one with the blue binding like that. The washi tape comes from Washi Wednesday. And let's do a flip through of this one first. I've used my newest collage pack from my Etsy for the covers. So I definitely wanted to try those out. We've got a library card here. We can write the details of the journal there and my stamp. And then we've just got pockets, pockets everywhere. <laughs> sewing, lots of sewing, vintage French seed packets, more of the collage pages throughout the journal. These are the vintage French collage tags. This is the vintage ledger paper, and this is um, vintage French book page. Then we've got vintage French envelopes, and more of my collages used as journal cards. Love this page here. Envelope there, and all different types of papers. So we've got tracing paper, and this is vintage music paper. I actually paper clipped in a receipt there. That can fold out for some more journaling space. This is using vintage French dictionary that I stamped on. So that's just an envelope that can be um, flipped open. And then we've got journal card in the tuck spot and the vintage French receipts, more tuck spots and journal cards. <laughs> Love this pocket. This is vintage French, I mean, sorry, vintage lace and just tucked in a large envelope in that one and I'll go a bit quicker because um, this is just the other side of that signature and then we've got a Rolodex card in there love this one I think this is one of my favorites this is vintage lace and then just more things tucked in more vintage French book pages ledger and Oh, I love this one. That's so pretty. <laughs> Vintage French receipt, coffee dye paper, blue index card. I think the other one has a yellow index card. This is a envelope, an envelope that I have um, covered with tissue paper that was French themed. That was fun. Love this piece there. Um, so these are available if anyone is interested. Um, just email me. My email will be in the description box below and let me know what country you're from so I can include a shipping price. This is a vintage French vocabulary card. Um, also, just um, let me know if you want the blue one or the yellow one. <laughs> and that one is journal card in an envelope. And I like this one, how it has the handwriting on it. So, so cool. And more of the same types of things. Vintage French receipt. This one's a postcard. Lots of tags and seed packets in there. Envelope and tag in that one. Middle page here. So pretty. I love the vintage stamps too. The vintage French stamps. So <laughs> lots and lots of pages, lots and lots of pockets and ephemera. I'll do a quicker flip through of the yellow one. Oops, sorry, bumping you. So this one I went for more of like a yellow and pink themed journal. Vintage French book page, but all the same type of thing. All these same amounts of things just different collages that I've used to tie in with the color theme and to distinguish it from the blue one as you can see all the other things are pretty much the same and as well if you want to make your own vintage French collage journal you can do that um, there was a series that I put on my channel of how to make this from start to finish that you can follow along with um, and pretty much most of the pages and ephemera and pockets are available in my Etsy um, we've got the collage packs, the 
seed packets, the envelopes, that's not an envelope, <laughs> the envelopes, the ledgers, and the receipts. That's all there in case you would like to have a go at making your own one. Okay, so, so there you go. I hope you like them. I love these ones. They're my favorite, favorite journals because they're filled with all of my favorite, favorite things. <laughs> so I hope they can be a special treasure for someone out there. And um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.